This is Trusted Renovation. Over 25 projects, over 25 top companies in their field, all working toward one goal, to turn a dated 1970s ranch house into the dream home for one couple and their family. Here's just one of the companies who took on this amazing challenge. Hey Jennifer. Hi, how are you? Uh, I'm doing good, how are you? Good. Good. I um, just want to let you know that we've ran into some soil testing problems. Okay. And that, um, I'm going to introduce you to the soil tester on site. Uh, this is Bob Kendall with Kendall and Associates. Hi. How are you doing? Bob, how are you? Glad to meet you. I want to explain to you just a little bit about how a septic system has to be permitted. Uh, the okay. health department requires that you put your, your septic trenches two feet above the water table. And we've run into some water table issues out here. Uh, I know that's not good news, but, not good news. but I want to uh, explain to you how we, how we can overcome that. And on this property, you're going to have to put your trenches at a shallow depth to stay above this water table. Uh, Billy and I will consult about uh, what the best solution is for the, the type of system you need. Uh, what we do is deal with the health department to get your permit. Okay, but it is doable to put the septic lines out here? It's doable. It, it'll, it'll take what we call an alternative system, a pump that will have to lift the effluent to a shallower depth so that you can stay above this, this water tank. Okay. Now by raising that to a sh the drainage pipes to a shallower depth, is that going to make it difficult for any landscaping or anything I do out here? No, the, you can proceed with putting grass and regular ran landscaping mm -hmm. out here. The main thing that you'll avoid is, is where the sewage pump area is. Mm -hmm. You need to keep that area clear. But as far, again, as far as where these leach lines or this drain field is going, you'll be able to plant and have things like you normally would. Okay. So all I care about is that it's doable to move those lines because a big part of purchasing this home was to move the lines out here so we could put a pool out back.